This is Alan Bush with the Daily Financial Forecast for Thursday, November 12th. Stock index futures are mixed, although the NASDAQ is higher. Also, it does appear that while traders are focusing on the political situation, ultimately, though, I think it will be the interest rate influence that dominates, as it always has, at least for the last 12 years or so. So that remains an underlying bullish factor for the stock index futures. Moving over to the currency markets, seeing the dollar index under a little pressure today. Uh, the dollar now in a five-day congestion pattern, and this does look like a uh, flag pattern. Ultimately, I think we will break out to the downside. Also, the dollar index is likely to trend lower longer term. We have the euro currency trading higher, even though we did have some negative economic data out of the eurozone. Longer term, I believe the euro currency will tend to drift higher. In the interest rate futures markets, yesterday we saw the 30-year bond futures falling to their lowest level since April. Since then, there has been somewhat of a recovery. But longer term, it still appears that rising inflation levels will probably put pressure on the long end of the curve, at least futures at the long end of the curve, while the front end remains stable as the Fed has pledged to keep interest rate policies unchanged through 2023. Also, the gold market appears to be giving us a false sell sig signal on Monday when it penetrated a double bottom pattern at the 1851 level. Since then, the gold has rallied over $30. So that's an encouraging sign technically that the gold market will continue to recover. So good trading, everyone. And once again, remember, these are my opinions alone and are not the opinions of ADMIS or ADM.